Okay, so here it is. This is the full screen video home page that we're going to make. Okay, so I'm going to break it through into three steps. Step one is we're going to add a transparent header up the top. Step two is we're then going to add the text here. We're then going to add a button and the social icons. We're then going to put the video image in the background and then we're going to make sure it fits on full screen. Okay, let's get into it. Okay, so we are logged in. So let's build a new page first of all. So we're going to go pages, add new. Uh, we're just going to give this a title. We're just going to call this video testing okay and then you want to change the page attributes to elemental canvas and the rest of it can stay the same so publish that okay now for the time being we're going to go back because I want to just show you the menu setting so we do need a plugin for that to get a um, to get a transparent header, so we're going to install this plugin here. It's called Elementor Header Footer and Blocks. I'll just show you what it looks like. Okay, it is that one there. So Elementor, header, footer and blocks, just install that, activate, okay, done. Once you've done that, we're going to go to Appearance, Header, Footer Builder, and then we can make these here. So these are like sort of mini Elementor pages that we just use them as headers. Um, so I'll show you, I'll go through a quick one, completely a, a, a complete build of one now. So if we go header footers template add new. Okay, type of template. We want a header. And we don't have to worry about those rules. That can all stay the same. Just call it something. Testing. Right, edit edit with Elementor. God, can't talk today. Okay, here we go. Right, we're in. So now this is you'll be familiar with this it's exactly the same interface so we're just going to make a new one so i'm going to do a two column layout okay and then we're just going to put in what parts of the header we want i just want a logo and a menu so we're going to select if you go scroll down to the bottom now, you've got another little section here of blocks. If you put in the site logo, that'll be the one that you've already got on the site. So that one's already there. We're going to align it to the left. If you want to change it, you can. You just need to go custom image. So if you want to change it, you can put another one in. Okay. And then this one, we're going to put the menu in. So again, scroll down to the bottom, navigation menu, and then just put that in. And it will choose, you can choose which one. We obviously had three, so I'm just going to choose the primary one. We can change the layout, move it to the right. Right, so yeah, we're just going to move that down. I'm just going to put a little bit of spacing on it, a tiny bit. Just to bring it down a little bit. Okay, so that's a bit more central now. Okay, good. Update. So we've got our menu. Actually, we're going to change that text a different colour. I'm going to make that white. You'll see why. Um, because the video I'm using in is a bit dark. So we're just going to change that to a white. There you go. It's completely gone now, but we know it's there. Okay, update. So we can now go back out 
Right, so that's now in there. So if we go appearance, header, footer, builder. So there's the latest one we made, testing, right? And then I'm just going to copy that short code because we'll need that in a minute. Okay, right, now we can go pages. Let's have a look at the page that we we're going to build. So we're going to build video testing, okay? So we're going to go to edit. Then we need to edit with Elementor. So edit with Elementor. Right, so first thing we want to do is we want to put a single section in. And we're going to go full width. Yep. Uh, yeah, okay. And now we're going to put our menu in. So if we go to the short code, we can drag the short code section in. And then we're going to paste in our menu there. Okay, so that is our in there. Obviously, we can't see that yet because they're white. Um, now we're going to put in a our header. Just drag it underneath. We're then going to put a button. Okay, button. And then we're going to put some social icons, which are down in here, underneath. Okay, so let's line all this up central first. We will change it a little bit. Okay, let's go in and change the style. We want to make the text color white. The background uh, transparent. Put a double border on it. I'll just show you what that looks like now. So that will look like that. We'll leave it like that and we'll change it at the end. Okay, so that is our content. We're now going to pad some of this out. So we want to give this section a bit of padding. So we can click in. Advanced. This is where we can move. Put some margins on it. I'm going to put a big margin on. About 180. Okay. We we'll make that whole text a lot bigger as well. Typography. And what did we say we were going to put on there? Okay. And probably make that a little bit bigger as well actually you can do that you can play around with this there's all sorts of make it bold anyway you get the idea right so now the main thing then is we want to make sure our video fits so for that we're going to go back to the whole section and we want to go height fit to screen now you see that will sort of move it all down. But then we go to the column position. We want to put that at the top. That takes it all back up. But this is still now full screen. So now we want to add our video in the background. So to do that, we go back into this screen, the whole section. And then style. And then background. Video. Now you can obviously put your own link in which I've already got. So I've uploaded one into the media library. And then you just paste that in. That's one way of doing it. So you see that whole works now. So now we can just go into this, change the colors around. Let's make that white. And this is the button that we wanted white as well. We can actually make the button a bit bigger. Maybe even a bit bigger. Okay, good. And there you go. If you want to put a break in this, 
um, you can just use the HTML BR and then that will break it down a bit but give it a line break and there you go so look at that amazing full screen video home page brilliant really really good I mean these are excellent for some clients love them you know I, I, I really am a fan there is there's a time and a place for them um, but this you know they can get some really good conversions and gives that sort of wow factor to the to the website when you first open it up so if you haven't got a video of your own that you can put on the background then if you go in you can also put a any so right let's go back to edit the main section now if you haven't got your own video you can put any YouTube or v Vimeo link on there so we'll just show you what I mean so if we get a I've just searched for some YouTube stuff so I'm gonna select this I don't know what this is like so we just pause the video and I'll just grab to cut the URL so we're just gonna literally get that so copy that okay then we're gonna go back and paste that into that and it, sometimes the problem with these is you don't really know what the beginning this one looks okay and there you go so look at that amazing I mean you might want to change the you could change the font color if it doesn't quite suit you could maybe make that a bit darker you can put an overlay on it so if you wanted to so now you've put your video on you can put a background overlay on that you just click on that and this will and if you go into background type instead of image just click on color you can actually change the whole the way the, the way the video looks you can make it darker you can make it lighter so you can do it like that which is a really good way of doing it there you go so now that that looks a bit better it obviously blurs out the logo a bit but you'll have to play around with it so there you go hope that helped um, really good really easy way this is all using Elementor the theme I'm using is Customer 5 you probably you, well, you can you pretty much do it as any theme um, Elementor page builder Customer 5 theme so there you go video backgrounds thanks very much for watching please hit the subscribe and I'll be back to you with more soon